What is up, Ace Games TV? Bojangles23 here doing a Halo 4 uh, Dominion game game type. Yeah, game type. The uh, game type overview for you now. Um, if you don't know what Dominion, Dominion is, it's kind of like Domination. And if you don't know what Domination is, uh, it's from Call of Duty, obviously. Well, actually, not obviously. You might not know that. Hmm, fun fact that today, people all don't know what Call of Duty is. Hey. All right. So, um, if you don't know what Domination is, yeah, I'll just give you a quick overview of that. There's three flags. Yeah, capture. Try to capture as many flags as you can. The more, the more points you get, the you win. Basically, that's that's the domination. And Dominion uh, is kind of the same way, but it has a big twist on it. And honestly, it is it is actually fun if you know how to play. Um, but if you your team kind of sucks, then you kind of have a bad experience with it. And you don't have fun. So I'm gonna start off with it's basically just like a regular. I think it's a 6v6 uh, game like game size. I'm not sure it might be that. I know it's not a 4v4 because they're played it on big team uh, game maps like this one, Exile. Um, so yeah, it's 66, red versus blue, uh, played on mostly big maps. Uh, it is played on some maps, I don't know which maps they are, I've only played it a couple times. But I just had to get this gameplay so I could show you and tell you about it. So, what you have is when you start you have A, a flag. C flag and B flag. Basically, they're not flags. They're kind of just capture points, but I just like calling them flags. We'll call them flags in this video just to make it easier for me and you guys to understand what they are. Um, so, basically what you do is you have to walk up to... It's kind of like a pedestal thing. You have to press X, activate it, and it starts capturing. Um, you'll see this multiple times as it's saying capture, capturing. And once it's capturing, anyone can go for the point. Um, and then sometimes... Uh, people capture it back, you have to get it back, blah blah blah. It's basically just a, who can get the most flag caps uh, and who holds the most flag points wins the game. But the twist is, once you get the flag captured, a barrier shows up around the flag and you cannot get into the base. I think there's only, I haven't really figured it out, I think there's only like a couple ways to get into bases. Um, I think they leave little gaps or like little openings where you can get in and capture the base on yourself. But um, it just depending on what color your team you're on covers the outside of the base in like a certain area where people can't get in in the color. And if you see here right now, I'm destroying a turret. Like once you uh, capture a base, you can activate turrets which shoot at anyone that enemy uh, or anyone that's hostile against you. Shoot them. It won't really, it doesn't do that much damage, it just does like kind of like assault rifle damage, but a little dumb down. Um, so that's basically it. Not much to this game type. Uh, it's basically capture the three flags. Once you capture it, you will see a blue or red ring, uh, kind of like a wall around it. Not past that wall, only if you are on the team that owns it, you can pass through the wall. If you're on the ending team, you can't. Um, also, there's another big twist you maybe see in this video. I don't know. I'll, I might cut it in just to show you. Um, it is if you capture all the points and you get every point captured, uh, the game is basically over until not basically over. It goes in kind of like a sudden death uh, type thing where you have where once everyone on the enemy team dies and you have all the flag points the game is absolutely over so if you have a really good team you can rush in capture all three bases and then kill everyone and that's that's it that's happened to me a couple times it's kind of kind of sad you know in like five minutes you get triple cap and you all die <laughs> and basically you're screwed um so that's basically it uh, going through this um is a quite fun fun game type I'm gonna, I'm, I'm gonna do a couple more game type videos. I think I need to do flood. I will go for that. Um, what they added? I don't think they really added anything. I did regicide. Um, that's basically. It. Also, I'm gonna be do some Black Ops 2 videos. Uh, just going over, not going into like deep, deep details and videos and stuff like that. I'm just gonna do a couple small videos here and there, going over some of the stuff that I like, like balancing and stuff like that. That'll be the next video I'll be putting out. Uh, so, um, that's basically it for the video. I'm Bojangles23. I hope you guys like this video. I want you guys to like and subscribe.
to Ace Games TV because we do have a lot of directors. And one last thing. Wait, 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 real quick. This this part right here is what I'm talking about. If you capture all the bases, you can put kills over everyone's head. But back to the end um, outro. Uh, if you are looking to be a YouTuber and you have some kind of recording capability, uh, you guys should apply to Ace Academy. They are accepting anyone uh, who has decent content and your your videos will be posted there uh, and if you are good enough they will move you up to a regular channel which is Ace Games where I'm at. Uh, so go there if you want to pursue a YouTube career and get paid while doing it. Um, go subscribe, not subscribe, well you can subscribe to Ace Academy and go uh, apply there right now. So thanks for watching and uh, I'm out. Peace.